Hey guys, it's Kendra. Today I'm here to do a haul on the stuff that we got from the baby shower. I wasn't going to do this because, I don't know, it's just overwhelming. It's a lot of stuff. But I got so many of you guys who wanted to see this video. So, I just lugged everything in here. Not everything, but a lot of it. I'm glad I'm doing this video because once I film this, I can like take everything out of the box and start washing a lot of stuff. I haven't washed any of their clothes yet or any of that. Everything's just in packages. So I'm just getting like so overwhelmed, there's so much stuff. And when I have a lot of stuff, it just makes me like. And then I did have to exchange a few things just for different colors and prints. So I'll show you that stuff as well. Um, so I hope you guys all enjoy this and I am doing this video not to just show you like all the stuff that we got because that's never my intention. I just want to help those of you guys out who are maybe doing your baby registry and just need some ideas for things to add to it. Um, and for those of you guys who just want to see, who are just curious, hopefully I can get through this. <laughs> These last couple days have been a little rough. My stomach has been so tight and I've just been getting no sleep because my back is wrecked. But let me let me show you my stomach right now. I had to order some bigger size clothes. Like, it's getting really, really big. So I'm now the size of like a full term pregnancy, yet I still have two more months. <laughs> oh boy. So the first things, these are actually... I think I exchanged the ones that I got, which were originally on my registry, but I decided that I wanted to get organic cotton. So I got these from Bye Bye Baby, and I will do my best to link everything that I possibly can for you guys uh, down below. So I got the fitted crib sheets. These are 100% organic cotton, and I got the little pink, they have little pink bees on them. So these were $17.99, not that cheap, but a lot of crib sheets are pretty expensive. The other ones that I got, that I exchanged, um, were just like the sateen ones and I already have a pair of sheets that fabric. So I have those on their crib right now. Uh, but I wanted to get these two to see if I like this better. Next I got the um, changing pad covers, both from Bye Bye Baby. 100% organic cotton, I got a pink and white one and Still waiting for a changing pad to come in the mail. And I wanna get some of the toppers that you put on top of these so you don't have to wash these every time. Uh, if you guys have recommendations on your favorite changing pad toppers, like the waterproof ones, let me know. I know there's, um, I think they're like the Boppy brand. There's a couple on Amazon, but I'm not too sure which ones to get yet. Next, I have this super adorable thing. Oh my gosh, um, Andrew's mom got this. And it's this Noah's Ark. Let me turn it on. And so it's Noah's Ark because Noah's Ark, you know, it's animals in pairs of two. And she had it engraved and it said they entered two by two. So this was just so special and I think this is so adorable. So I'm going to put this on a little, we have a little side table in the nursery, but I mean, that's just precious. Next I have the Chico Natural Fit Bottle Warmer. This is the digital bottle warmer. I got this because I was reading a lot of twin blogs and registry tip types of things. And this was on there just because it said it makes things a little bit easier. So um, yeah, got that. Next, uh, Andrew's sister got us two of these. These are from, what is it? oh, it's called Things Remembered. That's where that um, other nose arc thing is from. So they're two jewelry boxes and I thought they're just so adorable. I had been looking at jewelry boxes anyway, so I thought it was like perfect that she got these. And look at the inside. Little ballerinas in them, they're so cute. So I just thought that was so special. Next, oh here are some little bows that she got us as well. These are both from Nordstrom and they are the Baby Bling brand. And they're just really nice, soft fabric. All right, here's the monitor that I registered for. One of my friends recommended this one to me. I don't remember which one. I think I had the, I had one of my registering and she was saying that one's not good, it broke on her. So this is the Summer Infant Wide View digital video, digital color video monitor. And we also got a separate camera in case we need two. I'm not sure if we're going to need it yet. So um, we need to hook this up and see kind of how much it covers 
in the nursery and figure out if we need to add the extra camera, but um, yes, heard good things about this. I also got these. These are the Natural Organic Cotton Fitted Waterproof Quilted Mattress Pad Covers. So I got these to put on top of their mattresses and then we'll put the sheet over that just in case, um, you know, they go to the bathroom and we don't want it to leak all the way down to the mattress. So um, it's just soft, breathable, organic cotton and yeah, bye bye baby. Bye bye baby. Okay, more Burt's Bees stuff. I went a little Burt's Bees crazy. These are all from like exchanges that I had. I got some washcloths, just the little baby washcloths and then some more hooded towels. I have two of the Aiden and Anai hooded towels. And I think I have one other kind of towel. Oh, from Carter's, I got some. But these ones just felt really soft and I f I'm like, we're gonna need these, so. We also got some binkies. These are the Advent Soothy ones. And these are the ones that they gave at the hospital. So I got like a couple different packs of these. Who knows if they'll even like them, but I figured I might as well have some just to have on hand. Next I have some of the Halo Sleep Sacks, and these are the swaddle kind. And I found these ones at Bye Bye Baby. These were the organic, certified organic ones, which I thought was awesome. And these are in the newborn size. These were $24.99, and I have just heard really, really good things about these. I have been watching so many newborn essential videos, and a lot of people said that they really liked the Halo swaddles, so I have two of those. And I also got two, where are they? Uh, I, th I don't know if I brought them in there. I got two pink ones as well. They're just the regular Halo swaddle sleep slacks, sleep sacks as well. So I have four of them total. These are the Gerber um, cloth diapers, the pre-fold ones. I got these to use as burp cloths because a lot of people said that Typical ones just aren't absorbent enough, so these are just easy to throw over you, and they're not that expensive. You can order them on Amazon. These are from Bye Bye Baby, but um, you can get these on Amazon too. So I got these to help with spit up. Here's a couple clothes that I got from Target. Again, I exchanged something there. So these two are the newborn, they're by Carter's, and they're the zip up onesies. I think these are boy ones, but they're gray and I thought they were really cute. They have the little bear and the little bear on the feet and they're like a quilted material. Like they're really thick. A question for you guys, those of you guys who have babies and have kids, do you, when you're using their pajamas, do you always put a little onesie underneath? Like just a white basic onesie underneath? Let me know if you do, because I wasn't sure about that. And then this one I saw, they only had one, but I, I don't need everything in doubles, I realized. Um, I just wanted a couple more newborn zip-up onesies that weren't snaps. So this one has these little cute animals and the little monkeys on the bottom. And um, this is, again, Carter's. The next thing I have is the Graco Sleep Slumber Sound Machine. Again, another essential for twins that a lot of people said because in case one baby is making noise you want to have this to kind of blur that out so that the other baby doesn't wake up every single time. So I thought this was going to be way bigger. I'm really happy that it's not. It's super little. 12 soothing selections featuring white noise, nature sounds, and lullabies. There's an auto timer, soft glow nightlight. Ooh, I didn't know that. So now I don't need to buy a nightlight and you can plug in or use the battery. So, and it says good for travel. So there's that. Next up, I got a humidifier. Another recommendation from a friend. She was saying that whenever her son is sick, she always uses this and it helps so much. This is the um, ultrasonic cool mist humidifier. And it's not like we're gonna use this all the time. I'm not gonna just keep this out in there nursery all the time, but just kind of when I need it. Okay, next up I have another diaper bag. I know I showed you guys that one diaper bag in a previous pregnancy video, but I wanted to get two just for convenience. So this one is the Honest Company City Backpack. And this one I thought was really good because Andrew said that he would totally use this. So this is from Nordstrom. And this is my favorite part about this. Um, this zipper compartment has an insulated pouch right here. So you can put snacks and bottles and whatever you want in there. And then there's a built-in, like it comes with, where's the inside? Um, changing pad cover, a little like duffel bag to throw dirty stuff in. 
and just a lot of compartments and it's just simple and easy and I like that it's leather, just like easy to clean. Okay, next up I have this giant thing here. This is called the, I think it's the Twinsy Pillow. It's not the um, My Breast Friend one, it's the Twinsy Pillow. So this is the cover that it comes with. I need to wash that still. I haven't washed anything yet, but this is what it looks like. It is humongous, guys. <laughs> what you do, you can use this as like two different boppy kind of pillows, lay the babies in here to feed or whatever, but what you can do to feed them, you lift this up and you have a little backrest and then you have your two separate pillows to tandem breastfeed. And I've just heard such good things about this. This is from Amazon. It is a little on the pricey side, but everybody said it's totally worth it. It has really, really good reviews. So I got that and then I also got an extra uh, cover for it, just in case. All right, next up we have a wipe warmer, another recommendation from a friend. She was just saying that this helped a lot in the middle of the night when she would do her, you know, when she's changing her son's diapers, it just wouldn't like make him cry more or anything. It just was nice. So um, this is the, is the company? I think the brand is Prince Lionheart. So it's just like the gray and white one. Okay, my battery died, so I'm back. I have a lot of clothes now to share with you, some little things. And then at the end, I'll talk about things that are big that I don't wanna like bring in here. So here's some cute clothes. These are little tops from Gap um, in the six to 12 months size. Super cute, we got so many clothes. These I registered for, these are from Baby Zara. Can you even handle the cuteness? Look at the little kitty on here and they're little like terry cloth sweaters. I thought these were just the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. These dresses are from Old Navy. These are three to six months. Old Navy has so many good deals. Like I just can't get over the deals. If you want super cute, inexpensive baby clothes, check out Old Navy. They have so, so many. These are from Baby Zara too. Ugh, like Baby Zara just has really simple, but like adorable, almost vintage-y looking clothes. And then they have the little buttons all the way down and it's kind of like a velvet material. These are also from Old Navy. <clears throat> they are the zero to three months and they're these super soft onesies with the hood and they have the little ears on them. And they're gonna be born in the winter time, so it'll be cold, so I just wanna bundle them up in these little sweet pieces. I'll just, I just grabbed like a couple things out of their, not a couple, a lot of things out of their dresser just to show you some, if you guys want some clothing ideas. These are from uh, Babies R Us, and they are little leggings with the ruffles on the butt and the ruffles down below in three to six months. These are from H&M and they are the organic cotton. So really cute kind of like cross, the ones use that cross over. And then this one again is from H&M and they are made with organic cotton. These are really, really soft. And those are zero to three, zero to three? No, two to four. These are Burt's Bees Baby and they are, these might be my favorite thing that we got. They're so soft and they're really thick and I just love these so much. These onesies are from Gap, very similar to the Old Navy ones. Old Navy and Gap just has really cute prints for their onesies. These are from Carter's. I keep saying these because I have doubles of all of them. Um, it says the cutest niece ever. These are from um, my sister-in-law. She got two of those for us. Here's another one of the onesies from Gap. It says, I love daddy, super cute. And then this is from Carter's. It's the, it's a, yeah, three months um, with the little hearts. And then on the bottom it has little, the little footies. And I did, the other ones I got, the gold ones that I mentioned in another video, I ended up returning those because somebody said that they get ruined in the wash. But then I also heard that you can just turn them inside out and then it'll keep this intact. These are really cute. There are these gowns. Um, I think I found these from Bye Bye Baby and I thought they were perfect because they're going to be born in December right around Christmas and they have the little, um, you can cover their hands and then they're the just elastic at the bottom so they're very convenient but I thought, I mean, perfect for Christmas time. These are one of my favorite pajamas. They're again, everything that I love is from Burt's Bees apparently. 
just a really pretty floral print a lot we got a lot of onesies like this with the beanies that come with it so I don't know how much we're gonna use the beanies but um, these are nice because they have the buttons just right at the bottom to for easy changing but yeah we got a lot of like sleepers like this like here's this one from Gerber nice because it has the zipper I think you can find these at Target and then here's some little oh no this is another onesie from Gap love this print with the little zipper all the way down here's another one from Carter's so we just got a lot of a lot of PJs like this but I figured hey we're gonna go through these so fast Here's some super cute little um, crochet. Oh, God, that just dropped. It has the beanie and the little bottoms. If I want to do a little photo shoot or something, I guess, I can use these. And then, um, oh, here's another little one. I mean, just like a lot of little, like people just got us a lot of clothes because clothes are fun, you know. I did return a couple of them. Um, and then here are some super cute little beanies. These I saw at Bye Bye Baby. Here are the mirrors that I registered for, for our car. They are the Visi Premium Backseat Mirror. And you just put these, here's like a picture. You just put these on the back of your, um, or on the headrest so you can see your baby. So I got two of those for the car. And then here we got like some little toys and things like that, just like, little dangly things to put on the car seats and stuff. Here's a couple toys. I registered for these. I think they both were from Amazon. I love just like the wooden toys. They're just classic looking. And here are some wooden blocks. These are from Little Unicorn. They're the muslin swaddles and I absolutely adore the print of these. Oh my goodness, I'm obsessed. If you guys like following a lot of like baby companies on Instagram, follow Little Unicorn because they're so cute. As far as um, our high chairs, we got the ones from Ikea because they're very inexpensive. I heard they're just super easy to clean, easy to move around. We also got two gates, baby gates, to put around the house as they get older. I will link the ones that we chose uh, down below. What else is in the garage? We got like a big kind of bouncy thing for them. Just one because I don't need two of that. Like our house is not big, so there's no way anything like that would fit um, with two. It's just like a big garden. I'll find a picture. Garden? No, like jungle kind of play thing that you bounce in. We got one of those. And then we also got um, the two rockin' plays. Those I'm super excited about. They're by Fisher Price. I got the pink ones and they, I don't know exactly what they do. I know they vibrate and I think they rock themselves, but I heard that they're just essential for twins and babies in general, just because they're lightweight. You can bring them into different rooms. They can sleep in them. Um, so we got those. And then some of my friends got together and got us one of the bassinets from Pottery Barn. So I was originally going to get two, but I just thought that's unnecessary. So we're just gonna have one because if, like what if one baby doesn't even like it, it'd just be a waste of money. So we have one bassinet um, that we'll keep in our bedroom and kind of see how that goes. We also got the Four Moms Pack and Play. And again, I'll link all this down below, but that one was recommended to me by a friend because it's just super convenient. She said it's very, very easy to use. There are some other things like that we didn't get from our registry, but I'm still getting. So those things I will include in upcoming pregnancy videos, um, like I usually do at the end with products. Now that we have all this stuff, I just have to go through and organize everything. I feel like the first step is to just wash everything and organize it, put it away. I'm still waiting. The only piece of furniture left for the nursery we're waiting for is our changing table, which is technically a dresser. So once I get that, then I can really kind of finish all that. So, but it's so crazy. Like now I need to start thinking about, like I need to register for classes at the hospital. We need to take a hospital tour. I just need to start like thinking of all that stuff because especially with twins, like a lot can happen early on. Um, so, I mean, you don't want it to, but you never know. So I feel like I need, to, I just want to get the nursery done. So that's just out of the way. So I think that's everything for this video. I just feel like this was all over the place. Considering I got no sleep last night, I'm just struggling right now. But I hope you guys enjoyed this and found this helpful. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys very soon. Bye.
my type of twins, he likes to deliver them around 36 weeks. After that, things start to go wrong. Um, your placenta can start breaking down and the babies are actually safer out of the womb than inside of you. So 36 weeks is around. 